Hey everyone, have you having a really great day? I am here with a face of the day because um, I really liked my makeup today and I thought about doing an Instagram photo of um, my makeup of the day but I thought I would do a video instead um, just because I wanted to, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start with I guess my face makeup today. Uh, first I, as always, use my Urban Decay D Slick and then I went in with my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer which I'm running low on, um, but I love this stuff, really great. And then I'm wearing my Revlon Nearly Naked Foundation, which I just did a video on, a review slash, well not really a review, but like a demo, um, the one you guys requested a while ago, so check that out if you haven't seen it already. And then with that I use my Real Techniques um, buffing brush, which is really great because um, I want a little bit more full coverage today. Um, and then for my powder, I'm wearing my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, which I've been liking, especially today, because it's been um, a little bit warmer than it has been. And then, I guess for my blush, I used a combination of my NYX Cream Blush in Natural, which I love, and my NARS Blush in Madly which has been my absolute go-to combo for the past few weeks or so. Honestly, it's like the only blush combo I've been wearing lately. I love it. And then for my highlight, I have been wearing my Benefit Watts Up Highlighter, which is fantastic. I really, really love this. Um, so yeah, it just gives me really nice and natural look, which is great to pair with my smoky eye. Speaking of which, um, for my eyeshadow base today, I'm wearing Maybelline's Color Tattoo and Bad to the Bronze. Surprise, surprise. Um, but it just went really, really nicely with my eyeshadow combination today. So there's that. And then for my actual shadows, I use my Urban Decay Naked 2 palette. And the colors from that that I use today are YDK, which is this color right here. It's a really nice bronzy color. I just use this all over the lid. There's a swatch in case you haven't seen it. And then in my crease, I'm wearing Snake Bite, which is this more of a satin finish, like a dark chocolate brown color. So looks like that. And then to blend everything out and a sort of a highlight, I'm using Max Saddle, which the um, plastic cap actually broke out of recently, which is weird. Um, if, and if that's happened to any of you guys before, let me know how you fixed it. Um, but I just use this like I do every day of my life because I love it. And then for eyeliner, I use my CoverGirl Liquid Lime Blast, which is one of my absolute favorites. This is in the color Black Fire. And it's amazing. It stays all day. It's just, I love this. This is actually one of my favorite products last year. Um, and I'm still loving it. So I just did like a really thin line of that on my waterline. And then for my mascara, I'm using my Wet n Wild Mega Length today, which gives you really, really great length, obviously. Um, and it's very black and it's very wet, nice formula. And then paired with that, I have my L'Oreal Voluminous Million Lashes Excess, which I have really been liking. Um, the two together just gives you a really nice, natural, um, but still kind of defined look as far as your lashes go. And I think that is, oh, my lips. Um, I was going to say, I think that's it. But yeah, for my lips, I use my L'Oreal lipstick in the color Toasted Almond, which is just the absolute perfect nude for my skin tone. I'll swatch it for you guys. Really, really great color. Um, it's definitely more of like a pinky brown nude and not um, an orangey kind of nude, which is great. And then for my gloss, I am wearing NYX Lip Gloss in Beige, which I have not worn in a while, but I'm starting to kind of pepper it back into my routine lately, and it really just goes perfectly with this lipstick. So yeah, very happy with my makeup today. Um, like I said, I definitely felt like it was a smoky eye and nude look kind of day. I even tweeted that. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you have a great weekend as well, and I will see you later.